Good, Good evening. So uh, what, what is at the heart of this particular debate tonight? Well, I, I'm reminded of a, of a quotation I always liked from uh, John Kenneth Galbraith. He said that politics is the art of choosing between the unpalatable and the disastrous. <laughs> and that indeed is the, the choice that we face in the Middle East and it's the subject of, uh, of this debate. So we're looking at elected Islamists versus dictatorship. On the dictatorship side, what, what's the pro and the con on dictatorship? Well, the pro of dictatorship is that a lot of these dictators are fairly reliable allies of the United States. The con is that they are greedy, that they stay in power with repressive means, uh, intrusive security services, secret police, violence against dissent. And the pro and con of the Islamists? Well, the pro of the Islamists is simply that they are elected, and democracy is, is of course, a core value of ours. But we think of democracy as liberal democracy, and what we see in the Middle East is what I might call, or what Fareed Zakaria called, illiberal democracy. That's democracy without freedom of speech, without free exercise of religion, without a, uh, a, a clear rule of law, and so forth, that really represent our core democratic values. And let's go to the why now. Why now for this debate? Well, John, two words, Egypt and Syria. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's Robert Rosencrantz. Thank you, Bob, and that's the shape of our debate. Let's welcome our debaters to the stage.